Disaster management teams have been sent to the area to help people whose homes were damaged in yesterday's storm. The tornado developed late yesterday afternoon and quickly dissipated with videos of the unusual occurrence during rounds on social media in Guazulu Natal. Premier Sitlizigalala, as you just saw him, uh, is in the area assessing the damage. Uh, provincial Cooperative Governance and Traditional Affairs MEC Sipotlo Muga says the tornado left a trail of destruction in its path and community members are in shock. Our colleague uh, Vosi is there. Vosi, a very good morning once again. What's the latest? What can you tell us? Good morning uh, there as well as to the viewers at home. Yes, I'm right here at uh, Empolweni area. This an area that's under uh, Umshwati local municipality where tornado ripped through the area even as far as Greytown and other nearby areas such as, uh, I mean, uh, Peter Marisbeck, Hawick, Togozani. What you understand so far and what, I mean, the information that you have got from the ground is that two people have already lost their lives as a result of the tornado that took place here in the afternoon, um, late afternoon yesterday. Currently, I'm in here at the area where, but as you can see in my background, I'm just going to step out of this shot so that our camera lady and um, Lengubani can show you exactly the extent of the damage here at this house. As you can see, it has ripped it through the house. These are the belongings. Uh, we can, as you can see, the clothing, uh, the, 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 the blocks, as well as everything that's fell. That's the rubble that's there. Uh, the, you, you can see exactly, I mean, the extent of the damage here. Even on the roads, you can see that even on the yards, I mean, uh, the, the roof has been strong across the yard of this area uh, the whole or area of of, of uh, umshwati is almost like this whereby many 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 houses uh, have collapsed i'm going to ask uh, our camera lady nomlengoban just to come closer to me so that maybe we can have a word uh, with one of the owners of this house who has unfortunately lost one of her close relative Mama Sabon is a good son of Clope Scatinis de Maranjena. A Tambu Princegis and Jusconna Leca or Shoni and Tambushon and Ganjan. No good to buy Camalac or Nicamalac. Mina Gutunia Liwe or Ganso Sov Low Shoni Le Ospelel or Conna Lake. Bigger the slain Naila or Calaways. Kuimi <laughs> Gizu Tyler, Kubanga to Tyler, or Lozel, Godozela, or Tyler Rakul. Man getting it in your camp and your Pumagandi was Lozel and the Gua no dong, Utila or Seg. Now, like a marine soup, Pepu Gilegong. Man getting your Puma, Nang Lumaco de Lobela, Ukin de Zelo, or Sofa La Payan, Unga Pant, what would Guasala eat in the Peswak, managing getting Susit in as Suseg. Gentlemen, is Kala Besi Korn, Wapucha La Poge, Wapumag. Massa get him in a low whoop, Lona at Namang Mas, good whoop, got Delan. Quash on good night, say put to make Kaya, Giga Kaye, good Niope, good tak people, Gilly. Gasala can get to Agilan. Mang Sale again getting Gazam, good Lama blocks and was Mundo the Wasis of Makilana Lagam Kise. No Baba Langenzans, Bazane Sandal is a school, Bashaya was a bam tole go to Tungala. Bagway and Gaz good no ma. Way am a blocks, am Tendezela. Got a good name, go be good lines in go be room divide in Ayo, Nagal good Nayo, Iwile, Tambia Salapes, go out and Gaz, go big ning in Joguinzig. Oh, a seventy nine. Okay, okay, okay.
OK klung des bon cool mam si tabu sa ganya na we mam ah yes ma lo vuli here is saying that uh, she was here with Togozani who uh, was born in 1979 so he's probably uh, 40 years the one who died from here uh, she's saying that uh, while they were here inside last night i mean on the late afternoon uh, the whole roof collapsed and the whole building collapsed on, on them resulting to the death of the 40 year old male male person who was here inside they've really tried to ensure that they do free him but they and i mean their efforts ended up ended in vain but they also i mean sought the assistance of the neighbors who also tried but uh Tozani i uh, died i mean had their last spread right here behind me uh when the roof collapsed on them well uh, we've got the team from the premier the delegation from the Kazakhstan uh, cabinet led by KwaZulu Natal premier Sihlesi Galala as well as Kokta MEC Sepotomuga who are already here at, at this uh, municipality uh, currently we are told that they are getting a deep briefing from the local authorities here so that they can extend so that they can value the extent and also ascertain the extent of the damage here so they will be also going around all of these areas so that they will all, they will be able to 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 also discharge i mean assistance to these uh, victims of the tornado uh, that ripped it through in this area uh, i'm going to ask as well my our, our camera lady to also maybe uh, m- for me to step out of this shot i um, maybe i don't know if you can be able to see from here that side I and mean, the whole roof is scattered all over this area as you drive around here uh, there's plenty of roof being thrown around the yards i mean it, it, it seems that this is if uh, when the tenonte was in full swing everyone ran for their dear lives uh, trying to ensure that they do they do they, they are safe Uh, currently as you can see i mean the people from this area uh, they are trying to ensure that they rebuild their their the structures with corrugated iron is it as it as it is strewn across all of this area uh, they are trying to pick up the bits and pieces of their p- belongings uh, so that they've got something they've got a roof over their heads Uh, for, for now what i can say is that uh, that prim that the, the prim of was natal sihle zigalala with the mc so si posomuga they are currently at this municipality they will also be able to uh, offer assistance to the victims while well, there's quite a number of people who have been injured as a result as of now we are told that only 20 people uh, have be, have have been injured but only two have died as a result of teno- tornado uh, that excludes two a couple that died as a result of uh, uh, of the building that collapsed on them at inanda area but we also had another one at ukhlamba or in begville uh, that's kwazulu natal midlands uh, one person there who was struck dead by struck dead by lightning as well as four people uh, who were also struck dead by lightning at a uh, Joseni area that incident took place at Jose, uh, took place two weeks ago so you can say that in in a space of about two weeks there were nine people who died as a result of the uh, storms related incidents in Guazu Natal well we'll be updating you with all the relevant information as from this hour because damage has been done here there's so much de- damage uh, so many things that have been destroyed infrastructure roads as well as the power or electricity power uh, that has been interrupted because as you witness i mean i'm sure there's many people have got that video of uh, of the storm uh, of the teno- tornado that was uh, seen to going towards a sub a local substation here uh, that's also affected or uh, or affected uh, the electricity power here in this area of umshwati uh, currently as we're driving here we saw uh, i mean people trying to rebuild their structures to ensure that they've got roof over their heads but they are also pinning their hopes on government to also rebuild their homes as well it's back to you in the studio for now